All right, today I'm gonna to make what's called cerciado steak and green beans, two different ways. One with a steak, which is a ribeye, and a tiger prawn or shrimp. About a pound and a half of green beans, two onions, whole clove of garlic, which I'm gonna split up amongst both of them, three cans of tomato sauce, and soy sauce. That's it. All right, get your oil nice and hot, and then go ahead and throw in your steak. Just let it keep cooking until almost all that water is gone. You're going to start frying it up. You're going to go ahead and add plenty of black pepper. And I mean lots. Maybe a couple tablespoons, really. Or for your taste, but I like it kind of peppery. And I'll add some more later. Just when you start seeing the oil come up, you know it's ready to start frying. You can go ahead and throw in about three or four cloves of garlic. And go ahead and throw in one onion. Maybe just a little over. And of course, you can throw in some more black pepper. And just keep mixing and fry it up. So it gets a little crispy. Probably the total cook time for all this is somewhere around 20 to 25 minutes, really. You just keep going. Just keep mixing and cooking. You want that to start really frying up pretty good. Mixing it every so often. All right, I went and threw in some granulated garlic. And once this is fried up really nice, and somewhat crispy, you can throw in some of your green beans now. And just give that a good mix. This is where I go ahead and put in my soy sauce. And it's probably going to be close to A little over a quarter cup. I'll throw in two cans of tomato sauce. Just mix that all up. We're looking for a kind of a amber, orange type color. You can try it for soy sauce if you want more, put a little more. If not, leave it where it is. And just go ahead and turn that down. It's like a medium low. And let that simmer for about 10 to 15 minutes. Okay, so for this version of the cerciado, I'm gonna use shrimp. And I like to use a little olive oil to make sure your pan gets nice and hot. Put your olive oil in. And I don't put my um, onions or garlic in until after I have my shrimp in because I do not want them to burn or get too dark. So once that get nice and hot, you go ahead and throw in your shrimp. Okay, once that's nice and hot, and this is me made the same way, it's just made with shrimp. Now I have it with the shells on, you can remove it if you like. These already been deveined, they're just shell on. Mix. 
throw in your garlic right away. And your onion. Fire should be nice and hot. Even though the shrimp is cold, it's gonna cool down a little bit. Just keep mixing. Go ahead and throw some pepper in. You start getting a lot of color on your shrimp. I'm gonna go ahead and throw the greenings in. Some black pepper. Grab the garlic. And now your soy sauce. Quarter cup, throw in your tomato sauce, mix that up. And you want to go ahead and cover this and let this simmer on low for about a good five minutes, maybe ten or less. Serve it over rice. You can add more black pepper if you like. And that's really it. All right, now after that, has basically simmered for a good 10 15 minutes. Just go ahead and serve that with some rice. Ready to go. Enjoy. Hopefully you make it.